Mark Berman backstage here at House of Blues, Atlantic City for NJ.com. Hey, over 15 million views on YouTube. As an indie act, they struck gold. But hold on. Now, major label struck gold again. Taking Back Sunday is playing here tonight, and this is the lineup that you want to see. This is the original lineup here, and we're going to talk about it. We have John, Mark, and Sean here just to chat with us. How you doing? Very good. How are you? You know what? It doesn't get any better than this. You guys are hot. This is an amazing band. And you know what? I just love being here, and thank you for spending a few, few minutes with us. Hey, listen, let's talk about, uh, is the band from Long Island? Is everybody from Long Island? Yeah. yeah. Everybody but our singer, Adam, he's from North Carolina, but he moved to Long Island to be in the band. Yeah. I saw the latest video. Are we going to see Eddie on Dancing with the Stars now after the video? Hopefully. I would love to see that. I would pay to see that. If I could make that happen, I absolutely would. Uh, let's, talk about <laughs> let's talk about getting back together. The 2002 lineup, you had the hit records. You have the hit records now. Now everybody's back. Is there any animosity? Is it, is it easy working together? Basically, are you having fun? Yes, we're having a lot of fun. It's been, uh, it's been great. We've, uh, we, when we first got back together, like literally got back together in a room, it was almost immediately very fun. You know, we had our times of like kind of late night talking about serious things and sort of, you know, trying to come to terms with, with different things. But mostly it's just been like a family reunion and it still feels that way after like almost two years of being back together. Can you all write together and get the creative juices flowing again? Yeah. It all works? That's the only way this band works, really. It's always been the way. It's always a with this group of people super collaborative and we that's part of the reason we got together before we announced it that that we were getting back together is because we wanted to make sure once we got in a room together that we could still you know do what we used to do and it was very clear uh, immediately that we could precision bass uh no jazz you play the jazz on stage is that what you're touring with yeah yeah, yeah. i've uh for years i've been a jazz player i just love the feel i love the sound of it better than the p i like the two pickups for my hand positioning and stuff so yeah just the jazz felt right to me okay so so adam's out there and he's he's doing the front man thing anybody get hit with a microphone at all ever anybody get clocked only in the old days not since we've been back together right I did anyone get hit once in and when we played seattle last Oh, yeah. But it was my own fault. It was funny. I started thinking, oh, I've got this. This is no problem anymore. Hey, we know what we're doing. We've got a good thing going. The second I thought that, it was about half a second later, I got nailed in my ear. <laughs> and it pushed my in-ear in further and made me bleed a little bit. But I was okay. But since then, nothing. So wait a minute. So you're here in, in Atlantic City now uh, doing House of Blues. We're sold out tonight. Then you're going up to Allentown, Pennsylvania. But then, how exciting is this? Uh, South America, Brazil, Argentina, and Chile? Uh, yeah. You looking forward to it? Yes, we are extremely excited. It's going to be amazing. We we none of us have been there before. You guys never went without us, right? And we never went there without them. It's always a really exciting thing to go to a place that you've never been before. You know, after touring for ten years, it's like to go somewhere that's completely new is is awesome. I've heard that. Uh, I've heard like good things. You know, from the guy who's running the shows out there that. It's doing well, and the shows are going to be great, and so people yeah. are excited. People and that's are shocking. Excited. Yeah, we couldn't believe it. We don't even speak the same language, and they like our band. It's crazy. <laughs> Will you hit hit the beach in in Brazil? Absolutely. You know, yeah, looking I forward. Think to we that. actually have a few days off. We so we're gonna try to do as much as we can to see the uh, sights. And you toured Europe too. Yes. Yeah. You've been over. You've been uh, abroad as well. So tonight and the tour. Uh, the new album, Taking Back Sunday, you can go to the website, takingbacksunday.com. It's also the new album. We're going to hear from that, and we're going to hear some of the older stuff as well. Yes, a big mix of everything, really. Um, uh, you know, most, I think the biggest one, well, no, I think we keep it pretty, pretty evenly mixed yeah. throughout. It's like five or four songs from... Every album except one. One we don't play any off of, but <laughs> it's a big mix except for one album. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which album we will we won't hear we won't hear tonight? How was that? It was easy for me to say. Uh, it's called uh, New Again. We you know, just don't play any songs off that. <laughs> <laughs> Listen. 
don't don't try and listen they don't want you to hear it do not go to iTunes <laughs> it's please wow that's good that could go gold tonight <laughs> uh, we always ask this on the Mark Berman radio show who's on your iPod um well I I haven't been I I have my iPhone which I guess is like an iPod now anyway right it's all the same thing we'll settle we'll even take ready we'll even take cassette CD and eight track. I I've been listening to a lot of a lot, I always listen to Bob Dylan a lot. I I always enjoy him, and um, I'm listening to to Randy Newman a lot, which is a, kind of a new thing for me. I've kind of been getting into his catalog and Paul Simon. Kind of a lot of older, more um, laid back stuff. I'm getting getting old, you know. <laughs> yeah right. <laughs> what do you think? Um. Well, the 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 things I I. Just bought three things. I bought um, Adele yesterday. Stop. Stop. I'm sorry. No, I'm, I'm only kidding. No, I'm only kidding. She's great. She's great. I'm not doing that. You know what it is? It's an inside joke, but my crew here loves Adele. Oh. I mean, when she comes on the radio, they cry. She has a phenomenal voice. You That's why. Her all night, like Do you cry? Not all night. <laughs> but a lot of it. Wow. Wait a minute. So you were listening to him listen to Adele? <laughs> Was I falling asleep? You Did had I that song on for, for four hours all last night, night driving. I had, really? Literally all night that song kept You could have woke me up and said, hey, I man, you're enjoying iPod. I, I, was, I was asleep. We're in conversation with Taking Back Sunday. We're discussing Adele. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I also, other than that, I, sorry, I also bought um, uh, Temple of the Dog with, um, you know. That's such a good album. Yeah. It is. I really got to get that again. I used yeah. to listen to that all the time. And uh, and a lot of Beatles. I'm on a Beatles kick also right now. Yeah. Uh, I've got everyone from Coolio to Coltrane on, on my <laughs> iPod. Um, How long but, were you thinking about <laughs> that? <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right when you asked the question, I'm, got, I'm glad you guys bought. bought Isn't it great that? going last? I mean, yeah, you get yeah, to come yeah. up with it. Well, Coolio to <laughs> Coltrane. Coolio to Coltrane. That's yeah, that's yeah. something. But uh, lately, I, I, I've been, I've been, yes, I've been listening to this for a long time. A, a solo artist named Dave Haas. He's from Philly. Plays in a band called The Loved Ones. Put out a solo record called Resolutions that I love. Um, a band called The Mezingers. They have a they're a punk rock band from Philly. Also, uh, they have a new record coming out soon, and I really back that band. But also the Beatles and Guns N' Roses. Uh, the Ramones. I just got Rocket to Russia on uh, vinyl, so I've been enjoying that lately too. My favorite Ramones record. Actually, it's the end of the interview, but do you have a Philly connection? No, no, I just like the punk rock that comes out of there. We're about uh, 70 miles from Philadelphia here in Atlantic City, and uh, they do have some great stuff out there. Absolutely. Fresh Prince. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, well, hold on, hold on. It's West Philadelphia. He's born and raised. <laughs> yeah. I think on the playground, he spent most, most of, of his days. days. If I remember correctly. He, he was chilling out, <laughs> maxing. Is that it? Is that all you're Shooting doing? some b-ball outside of the school. And right across the hall, then what happened? the fresh, <laughs> the fresh prince or uh, the uh, jazzy Jeff just played across the hall. Just, oh really? Yeah, Does Jazzy was, do okay for himself? These Jazzy's Jazzy's I've still been mixing. Worried up. about him since Will Smith abandoned him all those years ago. Yeah, no, he seems to be doing well. He's doing producing and stuff, and we had a really nice interview with him. He's doing Good some stuff. A, like a really great uh, DJ, actually. Yeah, yeah actually, that's what he was him. doing in there. He was actually doing that, and it was it was a great night. It was it was big. This is taking back Sunday. They're out on tour. You gotta catch them. They're going they're going to South America, but they'll be back. Hey, you're gonna you're gonna do the rest of the country, aren't you? When you come back, you got stuff planned. Yes, we do. We um we can't talk too much about what's gonna happen when we come back, but the plans are are in the works as we speak. Taking Back Sunday, the new CD, Taking Back Sunday, self-titled. This is Mark Berman for NJ.com here at House of Blues in Atlantic City.